The Vex Mythoclass is a fan favorite returning Vault of Glass raid exotic, and it had a long reign of terror in Destiny 1, but that seems to be over. It's also one of the most confusing guns in the game. It's technically a fusion rifle, while the main perk says it shoots semi-auto, but actually is full auto, and the override perk is an 820 linear fusion rifle shot. In PvP, it kind of goes back and forth, with a good optimal time to kill of 0.83 and 100 aim assistance. It feels incredibly sticky and strong within 20 meters, but it has nearly half the range of other 360 auto rifles like False Promises. And the slow charging LFR shot does one-shot headshot enemy supers and feels quite sticky as well, but can be prone to flinch misses on mouse and keyboard. In PvE, it tries to be a jack of all trades while not really doing anything particularly well. Its regular shots are on par with 360 auto rifles with much less range, and its LFR shot does a little bit less damage than Arbalest with a much lower charge rate. In a way, this is a nice way to get special and mature damage with the primary ammo, but weapons like Hawkmoon and Terabud do this much better without requiring any kills. Honestly, the Vex Mythoclass kinda sucks.